Yo, what is up? This is Joshua Casper. Welcome to another Max 4 Live tutorial. Um, we've been kind of just moving along making this stereo swapper. And I know it's just a simple device, but I think we're learning about very important things while we're making this. So we started off with version 1 here, which was just kind of a toggle switch. Version 2, we added some labels and some gain controls that affect uh, the dry and wet signal inside of it here. And what we're going to do now is make this bad boy to make it just, just to totally make it look sweet. Um, I'm just going black and white with a little graphic here because, um, you know, I'm not that great at graphic design, but I want to show you how to do this. And obviously you can take your mad graphic skills and apply it how you want it. So let's go ahead and um, open up or what I'm going to do actually is show an explorer. I'm going to go ahead and delete the one I made, Stereo Swapper V3, and we're just going to go ahead and remake it um, right now together. So I'm going to get rid of this one. Um, both versions are going to be up on the website to download if you haven't followed along with us, but I definitely suggest that you follow along because you learn a little bit of something each time. So uh, go ahead and download it or follow along and get to JC Stereo, um, what did I call it, Stereo Swapper V2, okay? Um, and then go ahead and open up Max for Live, and this is what we've got, and I'm just going to open up this, and what I want to do now is add an image. So there's an image inside of the uh, Explorer here, and it's called FPIC, and I'm just going to drag it on there. And um, the image I have is right here. It's a PNG, so there's no background. And if I click on it, it says 231 by 169. So that's good. So I want to click on this, and I'm going to drag to 169, which is the height, uh, the default height of devices inside a live. So that's an important number to know. And then I'm going to come over to 231. 231, okay, and then I'm going to come over to the inspector, and I'm going to come down to the value, and I'm going to choose image file, and then I'm going to check, check that PNG, I'm going to hit open, um, I'm going to put include in background, ignore click, because I don't want, um, I don't want it to do anything, and then I'm going to pull it up, and I'm just going to kind of move it around here. Looks good. Kind of click it on the top there. Just make sure it's uh, where it should be here. Um, if you can see right now, this dark line, that's the height that it needs to be set at. So if I bring it up here, I'm actually going to bring these out so I don't get uh, that line that makes it center. So now I'm lined up here. I'm just going to bring it over, line it up to that line, come on now, um, actually I can probably just hit zero here, and dot, and zero here, yes, if you, uh, percentage rectangle, if you hit zero, zero, it'll line it right up in the corner where it's supposed to be. The next thing I'm going to do is pull up my, um, my gang sliders here. And you can leave them lowercase or you can change them to uppercase. It depends on what you want to do. And now that that design looks pretty much the way I want it, I'm going to come into file and hit save as. And I'm going to call it V3, obviously. Booyah. Hit save, and then it's going to update down here. And if you look, that's what the patch now looks like. And that's already looking much doper than before. So uh, if I hit save one more time just to be sure, and then I close this window, and boom, I've got my graphic in there, but I can still use my faders to use the stereo swapper. So that's how you add that background. Um, 169 pixels high is what you need to make your graphic at, whatever you want to do, and that's how you apply it. But anyway, that's a little something else, but we're going to keep cracking on this stereo swapper, or maybe start a new device, I don't know, but we're going to keep going, and we're going to keep learning inside of Max for Live. Anyway, we'll see you next time.